Hey there, doll friends! Welcome back! Today I made not just one, but two easy and cute half pony hairstyle wigs for your dolls. Now let's begin! Cover your doll's head with cling wrap and secure a cloth over with elastics. Make sure to tuck the elastic under the doll's ears. Brush in 3 to 4 coats of white glue, and here I'm using Elmer's glue wall. Once dry, draw a horizontal line at the back, just a few millimeters above the ears. Fill in the areas we'll cut off later too, like the ears, the corners of the back part, and the hairline, which again, you want to be as close to the doll's original hairline as possible. Once that's done, take it off the doll's head and trim off the excess. One hank of yarn will be enough for this project, and I'll be using this brands. If you want to know how I make my yarn wefts in detail, I have a separate video tutorial on that, so please go and check it out. To glue the wefts, I'll be using a stronger glue. Next, glue wefts until you reach this guideline. This will be your bottom half. For the upper half, glue wefts on the front edge of the wig cap. Once dry, glue wefts over it but in opposite direction. Then, brush the swaps over and tie. Or to make your life easier, clip it with a small clamp. I also added baby hairs inside the wig cap for a more natural look, but I recommend you do this before gluing the wefts you'll brush over to keep the inside of your wig neat. And you're done! Super easy, right? Now for the next style, instead of using straight ones, we'll use curled wefts for the bottom half. Glue your baby hairs, then glue wefts on the front edge of the wig cap. Glue another row on top of it, but in opposite direction. Brush it over and divide the upper half in six sections. Insert the first section between the second and third, and the second section between the third and fourth. Repeat on the other side and insert the sixth section between the fifth and fourth, and the fifth between the fourth and third. Then, tie the third and fourth sections and pull on this parts. Next, braid all the sections together and loosen it by pulling the sides. Since the very tip is too tiny for me to tie with elastics, I secure it with glue instead.
Cover the bald spots with tiny flowers and add a bow if you like to finish this sweet hairstyle. I hope you enjoyed my take on this super easy but super cute hairstyle. It's a basic one I'm sure you can make as simple or as complicated as you wish. I love seeing your work so tag me on Instagram and use the hashtag Mozikita look. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on future tutorials. See you in the next one. Bye!